Hey everyone, I'm Jay. Today we're watching the 16th episode of Helk. Oh, uh, last episode. Once again, the backstory continues. It is getting really friggin' good. And humans are awful. <laughs> Let's do this. Three, two, one, go. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They became buddies. Mm-hmm. Yeah, humans are trash. <laughs> Yeah, if Azadra is to be trusted, which I kind of do, honestly. He's a, he hasn't done anything wrong in the series yet, as far as I'm concerned. Other than being a dummy. <laughs> He's been a bit of an idiot, but I still love him. Uh, yeah. Deem's the one protecting the humans, for the most part. Because they're the ones that set up the friggin' barrier castle thingies to keep the monsters at bay. Hmm. I'm gonna see what this is about. Backstory is so freaking good. I'm loving it. Some quality backstory. We need some peewee in forever. You gotta give us some peewee. Give us pee pee. Truth behind everything. Okay. This is it. This is it. Let's go. Oh my god, I'm excited. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hmm. Oh. All right. <laughs> yeah, I was just about to say it's a spell. The puppets. Every citizen? Every? Whoa, man, that's crazy. That's legit insane, man. That's good. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. That's crazy, man. Yeah, it kind of is. So a couple, huh? Mm-hmm.
Okay. Yeah, naturally. <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. That is messed up, dude. That is so messed up. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. It's 500. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> That's hilarious. All right, let's go. Of course she was. Ah, uh -huh. it's two. Okay. <laughs> Four. Oh, yeah. It is. It's true. Yeah, we'll see how this goes. I don't think it as well, does it? <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, you guys are loud. Very loud. Nice. Well done. Well done. <laughs> yeah, I don't think Helk knows how to be quiet. He has one voice. And it's an outside voice. <laughs> You're also loud, dude. Oh, I thought it was Hulk the one that said that previously. Alright. Neither of them have an indoor voice. <laughs> one punch! Yeah! Help just pummeling them.
a half. <laughs> Help. Are you telling them this now, huh? In the middle of the rescue? I love it. <laughs> Talking is always a free action. <laughs> Ah. <sighs> mm. <laughs> he does. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, free action in every series except the evidence of shadow. <laughs> You're the loudest of all, man, by so much. <laughs> oh my god. That's a gigantic room. Big door, bigger room. Crazy size. I'm just going to lights pop on. There's going to be about a million of them. I start by trashing the magic circle that's drawn throughout the entire room. Hook's fist can do it. Just punch the ground a bit. Break it up. Oh. Oh, hello. Wipe them all out. Nah, they're becoming mindless puppets. You know it. That's the problem. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. When they first fought, when they first fought the heroes, when Hulk showed up and a kid came down with the angel wings, is that the kid that's with him right now? That's part of Alicia's party? Is that who it is? The one that then got impaled by friendly fire in order to not let him be captured or whatever. 
I'm almost thinking that was him. But maybe not. I'm trying to connect the essentially two storylines together. Or maybe it's not them. Hell, because I'm phased. <laughs> he awakened naturally. Does his voice carry weight to it? Oh. <laughs> he knows. Yep, he's gonna jump up, Annie. Class is about to awaken. Oh, what? No. Gotta be kidding me. Gotta take out the king, man. This is so messed up, and I love it. Hmm. Other world, huh? Other world, what? That's kind of cool. <laughs> Break the blade. Just disarm him, Hulk. It's fine. Just pop his shoulder. He'll, he'll be okay. <laughs> Man, that's crazy. He's right. It would. Nah, he can leave without his brother. You know that. No chance he leaves without him. And refusing to fight back. Oh, <gasps> Alicia, what? You sure? <laughs> Alicia, what'd you do? <gasps> oh, that's right, her special blade! Help, just grab him and run. <laughs> Just 
just a nick is all it took. That's awesome. Mm-hmm. That's right, grab and run. And now they're about to die. Yep. Stab him. Poke, 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 poke. Well. Rip Alicia. <sighs> Whoa. Okay, okay, okay. Wow. So that's what's exactly what's happening. They want to turn every civilian into an awakened hero that mindlessly serves them. Everyone but nobility gets turned. That is twisted, dude. That's crazy. Class is the key. Okay, okay. Class is the key, and the king is the word of God, essentially. It makes it happen. Hmm. Yeah, I'm looking at faces. There's that dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A bunch of them got turned into heroes. So it seems like... I don't know if Alicia was there. But after seeing the one guy, the the loud one, <laughs> I presume the kid is the one that uh, they fought to start with. Hmm. Now I understand why Helg didn't want to fight him. Okay, there's old there's old buddies who got turned against their will. Oh my God! Next episode, we continue the bad story. Yeah. Love it. I am loving this. This is very, very intense, very good, and yeah, this is just really good stuff. This is one of the, honestly one of the better backstories I have ever seen. I think it is really well told. It's a great story, and they're not rushing it in an episode. Like sometimes backstories are too long, sometimes they're too short. I think this one, despite it being on the longer side, is really, really freaking good. And yeah, I understand why Hulk wants to wipe him out, wants to stop him, wipe him out. To prevent this from continuing. Because it ain't good. It ain't good at all, man. I love it. That's all I got. Let me know what you thought. Bye-bye.